Hi, welcome back to the channel. Today is the final day, day five of our Peruvian adventures. This day again is starting out at the beach in Colón, the beautiful beaches in Colón. We were here for basically a day and a half and it was very peaceful, very restful, and it will be sad to leave. But I'm also eager to get back home at this point and check on my dogs and see how they're doing. So on this day, we have pictures of the back road that leads into town. And along the back road is tons of, I don't know, in the States we call it yard art. So they put all kinds of interesting things in their front yard. So that was interesting to see all the different things that we could find in different yards. And some of the houses were painted interesting. I saw a dog standing on the windowsill. I haven't seen that before. So it was, it was interesting going through the, the yards. We also went further down the beach and we saw some different birds in this little pond area. Basically, in a lot of the different places here, they harvest the salt for table salt. And so there was this one little area where they had little dunes of salt on one side that were, Susan <laughs> went and checked them out. She said they were rock hard. You'd have to have a pick to get it out. But anyhow, the birds there were just absolutely beautiful, of course. And I got some pretty good ones with them flying around. And then on the way out of town, we stopped at this church. And the church was really old. It's been remodeled. It's been there, I think, since the 1500s. I think 1572, something like that. Super cool old church. Um, Santi says it's the oldest church in South America. I kind of think he might be right. The other thing he told me was, well, we don't know when it's going to be locked up and when it'll be open and that type of thing because it has a lot of gold in it. I am impressed. The altar area, I don't know how, um, you know, you, you usually see in Catholic churches a lot of gold, but this one, the, it was all in the altar area and it was phenomenal. I mean, just absolutely phenomenal. Uh, I've never seen a church that absolutely beautiful inside. It had the rusticness of the wooden beams on the roof and the wooden pews for people to sit in. But then that altar was the only place that just glowed. It was gorgeous. I will have to say we drove by on Sunday morning and there was basically standing room only because outside the doors that they, they primarily use, there's a bench that goes all along the wall. And it was interesting when I saw it the first time when there was no service in there. But when we went back and there was a service, there were people standing outside, you know, along the, you know, standing and sitting on those benches outside, just run out of room inside the church. And that to me was just amazing. It was a really beautiful and peaceful sight. So we went back before we came home on Monday morning and the church was locked up on Monday morning, but Santiago got some incredible drone footage. So enjoy the drone footage. I hope you enjoyed the pictures and we'll have to find another place to go next time because that's the end of my Peruvian adventures for now.
Today is our last day. We head back to Ecuador this morning. We're gonna have breakfast and then say goodbye to the beach. See you next time. Ciao for now.